Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna cover how you can send an email directly after someone orders a product for any specific product or service that you have on your Squarespace website. So let's say you offer a service and as soon as they book the service, you wanna send them a custom email for that one particular service. You could do this at scale for as many products as you want. It's a little bit tedious, but you could do this for any products and do all of it in Squarespace. Let's begin. Cool, so the first thing we wanna do is inside our site, we already have products. So I just need to clarify that. There's already products in our store. But from there, I'm gonna go to marketing and then I'm gonna click on email campaigns. Now this is not apparent from the get-go. You have to kind of understand how it works. That's why you're watching this video. So what I'll do is hit create. So you have this feature here that shows you a few options of what you can do, popular. We're gonna go straight to say thanks to customers. Now this is all you, you can design your email and if you want a video on that, just drop a note below and we can create a video on that. But let's just say this is the template you wanna use. Boom, we're gonna use this template to start and now we're gonna start plugging in our information. So as you know, you'll come in here, do all your thing. I'm just gonna put logo, oh, don't have a logo. Okay, so let's see what text is. Let's put our demo site. Thank you for your purchase. Boom, that is that, there we go. Okay, so we have that set, we'll format the email, whatever we want. You could add a button here, so you can add a link to go to your site. So if you wanna add a document, there's a few ways to do it. One way I recommend is you could have a Dropbox link with that document, a link to a Dropbox folder. So if you ever update the document, it just automatically, it's still the same. So you link to a Dropbox folder, or you could link to a button that takes them to a specific page on the website, on your site. It's hidden, whatever you need, right? But it could be hidden, it could be password protected, and you could just provide the password in the email. There's a lot of different ways to do this, but whatever works best for you. So in this case, there's button text here, and we could say this is download document. And then here for the actual button, let's see, here's everything we need to know. So you'll see it says link. I'll click this little gear wheel and you'll see it says page, web address, email, or phone. So it doesn't give you an option for a document, but what it does give you is pretty useful because if you say a web address, this could be like a Dropbox link, whatever that link is, okay? So that can work and then you can format it, all that stuff. Now let's get to the good part. So let's go to email. Again, you'll have a lot of these other things set up. Oh, major note, should have said this in the beginning. This is a premium feature. So you do have to pay for email campaigns for this to work. So here is the magic. Let me zoom in here, automation after purchase. So I'm gonna click on that and it gives me a few options. Now this is beautiful. I'm really happy at how simple this is. When a customer purchase a product select, here we have like different products, all that. So you could specify the product, you could specify multiple products, or you could specify any product. So the entire store, however you like, you could search for products, which is really useful. But let's just say I select these three, I'll go back, you'll see any of three products, which is nice. Send them an email when, timing wise, immediately. You could do custom, basically, gives you a bunch of options here. So up to 60 days later, which is cool, but you could do immediately because that would probably make the most sense in this case. And then go back, boom, the automation is set up. And then you add subject, email, preview text. You'll have all this already built in. And basically you could activate the automation from there. And now you have just set it up. It's all good to go. And you could do this over and over again. So for now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back it's gonna save that. So you'll see there's an automation here. Now this is what it looks like as you build these out. So after you built the first one, you can easily duplicate it. You can go come in here, click on these three little dots, reuse template or edit the campaign, right? Or reuse template. And basically from there, let's do say thanks to customers. Now I'll do another one with a different Dropbox link, whatever that looks like. I could come in here and make those changes and then specify which product specifically. So we already did these three. Now let's say I want to do the other products in our store. 
We are good to go. I'll hit back. Now you'll see we have two automations. Simple as that. If you have a ton of products, it could get a little complicated. So best of luck. But this is a great way to send automated emails to customers immediately after. You could also send emails a few days later or something like that if you want to have a flow after the process is after they have purchased on your site. So this works for services, this works for products, basically anything you could sell on your website through Squarespace, it works great. Now, just cause we're here, I'll spend a few seconds talking about this. Let's talk about the plans just so you see. Their plans are actually quite affordable, but I think if you wanna just get started, this campaign will work. Sorry, no it won't. Automated campaigns, zero. Here at $10 a month, it's unlimited. So it's an additional $10 a month to have that automation. But if you think about, you do this four times a month, let's say you have to, you get a product order or you get an order and then you have to go in and create the email and send it. You do that four times a month, once a month, honestly, it's worth the $10 a month for it to be automated, saved and done. Friends, if you got value from today's video, hit that like button. When you hit the like button, it tells me that you got value from today's content. It tells the YouTube algorithm some fancy, important, critical information, but it tells me you got value from today's content. Next, if you want more resources for your site on Squarespace, anything from SEO to blogging, check out the links below. We have so many resources on our website and we're publishing new resources each and every month. So we have plugins, we have downloadables, we have free downloadables, we have blog posts, we have a ton of content, we have a ton of services, a ton of great things for you. Finally, if you want more content just like this, consider subscribing. We publish three new videos a week. My mind is blown that we're publishing three videos a week. It is a lot of content, but we're doing it for you. So three videos a week. If you want more, consider subscribing and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.